Dude, you paid how much for glasses? This is Act My Age. Lessons from a guy who's old enough to know better. I'm Brother Russ. Today, I would like to talk about eyeglasses. This is actually a really important subject because if you're like me and stuck with these things since the age of seven, uh, you end up spending a lot of money in your lifetime on eyeglasses. And if you do it the way that I had to do it growing up and uh, my early years, uh, early adult years, you have to go to the eyeglass place, you meet with an ophthalmologist or more likely an optometrist, you may go by the name of doctor, but he isn't really a doctor, he or she, uh, it's very strange. But whatever, this person sits there, they look at your eyes, uh, then they take some measurements and stuff like this and say, oh, you need eyeglasses and this is what it has to be. And they take you out into the other room and someone helps you fit a pair of glasses on you and then you turn over way, way too much money. I mean, uh, in fact, just this past fall, uh, I guess it was just after Thanksgiving, so end of November, beginning of December, uh, I have a vision benefit on my day job and I decided I better use it uh, because my glasses were getting kind of weak and so forth. So, so I went to a, uh, to a large brand here inside the mid-Atlantic U.S. area uh, which I won't name because, quite honestly, they're ridiculously expensive, even with, even with some really good insurance. Uh, I, I think it ended up being like three hundred and something dollars for a pair of, uh, you know, no-line bifocals, which is what I, I unfortunately have to wear these days. Um, but I made sure that I got a copy of the prescription, and I decided, you know what, this is the perfect time to go online and try some of these online glass places see what we can do now if you've been watching any of the menswear men's fashion channels recently there's one out there that gets plugged a whole lot called glasses usa i looked at their site they got some good stuff but their prices are actually kind of high even for online um they got some good product etc but you know i thought there's got to be better out there out here you know so i started looking around and so I came across first Zenny Optical, and Zenny Optical is, uh, here's a case from them. Um, in fact, these glasses that I'm wearing are from the, uh, from the expensive uh, store in the mall. And um, so I went to Zenny Optical and I decided, well, you know, I'm going to try to get uh, some of theirs. Now, interestingly enough, I got what amounts to pretty much the same sort of pair uh, visually a little different, not a whole lot, in a different color, which I thought would be useful. That way I can kind of change change off my glasses with my outfit. If I'm wearing grays and blacks, I wear the other ones. If I'm wearing browns, browns, blues, I wear this one. Um, and they've worked real well. So I also decided, well, you know, now being graduated bifocals, these are expensive. And I decided I wanted to see how cheap I could get away with. So I went for the lower end frames. I went for, uh, you know, not the options. They, there's all sorts of options about tinting and how thick your glasses. So I just went for low end. I wanted to see what low end would do. This pair of glasses cost me, with shipping, uh, I believe $56, give or take change, as opposed to 350 for the almost identical pair from the mall. And quite honestly, these have done really well. Uh, been wearing for several months, on and off with the other ones. I really don't see much of a difference between the two of them. I also uh, decided, you know what, um, let's try, I don't have the case for them here, uh, but, uh, well actually, I do have the case for this one. This one's Glasses Shop. I don't know if we can see that inside the reflection there. GlassesShop.com. And, um, now from from them I got a, you know I got something that's a that's a different style. This one I decide okay because of the way their pricing was structured, I'm going to get single focus. So basically these are driving glasses for me. So they allow me to see distance. I just decided I would cut out the business of the bifocal, get rid of the reading glasses. And these I got for rounded off $10. They have coupons, stuff like this. Once again, 
works fine for what I'm asking for. I leave it inside the glove box of uh, one of my cars, and now I've got spares for 10 bucks. For 10 bucks, I don't have to worry about not being able to drive home because I smashed my glasses somewhere along the line. I also, uh, uh, I also got no, excuse me, these ones picked up at Zenny as well, and these are also graduated bifocals. You see that they are a, you know, a larger lens size than the other one. Once again, 56 bucks works very well. Uh, so I've I've did that. Also did goggles for you. I don't have the case for goggles for you here, uh, but uh, uh, same, similar sort of deal. And once again, for goggles for you and glasses shop, uh, you can get and Zenny for that matter too. Come to think of it. If you get the coupons, some of them you don't even need the coupons, but you can get a pair of single vision glasses. If you don't have to have the bifocals like me, single vision glasses for under ten dollars, delivered. And here's the wild thing, okay? Because I, I went to the mall. I think it was on a Thursday night, Friday night, and to to order, I got them all confused here. To order this pair, which is my full price pair from the mall. I ordered these, and then I went online that weekend, and I ordered the ones from Zenny and for uh, from Goggles for You, and uh, they actually came in the mail before these came back at the mall. That's pretty weird. I mean that you know. I mean I I paid through the nose for these things, and yet I had both of those pairs on me when I went to pick this thing up. Um, so speed's not an issue. Price is huge. Now, if you read the online things about Zenny and some of these other ones, they say, well, you know, some of them, they don't wear very well. And some of them, uh, you know, if you get, you get the, all the expensive, uh, coatings and all this other sort of stuff, you know, the prices get up there and they can. So you have to be smart when you're doing this. And I would suggest if you play this game, try, try what I did. Try going with what works minimally for you. See how it works. And then, you know, if it's not exactly the way you want it, order again with with whatever changes that are going to add to the cost. You're still going to make out like a bandit compared to the, you know, compared to the frame, uh, the, the glasses that you buy at the mall. Because that's, you know, I mean, I like I said, I had good insurance and it was like 350 bucks. Um, if you don't have insurance at all, you're going to be paying a whole lot more. So... Uh, so I'd encourage you, uh, particularly if you're, you know, got family, you got kids, um, take a look at some of these online ones. And unlike what a lot of these men's fashions gurus are telling you, because you know they're making some money off the endorsement. Yes, glasses for you looks like, or, or glasses USA seems like it's got some really good stuff, but their prices are higher. So if you're looking to economize, try one of the other ones. Uh, try Zenny, try uh, Glasses Shop or Goggles for You and uh, give them a roll first and you know if you find you're not seeing what you want or you're not getting the quality you want then you can look at some of the other ones but um, but this is well worth it and frankly I am thrilled that I did this um, you know I wish I had had the opportunity to do this earlier in my life quite honestly but um, but I am thrilled to death with you know where I've ended up so I actually have the ability to change out my glasses. I even have, you know, I got ones with the uh, custom clip-ons and stuff like this for uh, for sunlight and so forth. That was like an extra three bucks or something like this. And they look, they just slide right on. They look perfect. Uh, you can also get them tinted for uh, as uh, sunglasses. I haven't gone that route. I really don't need it that much, so I just went for the clip-ons. But even tinting for sunglasses, not very expensive. So anyway, that's my encouragement for the day. Uh, take a look at some of these places. Uh, don't necessarily jump at these endorsed online glasses that you see inside some of these other channels uh, because they're actually a lot more pricey than I think they really need to be. So try some of these other ones that are a little bit more low end and see if they'll do the job for you if you need to economize. So if you like this, if this was valuable, please subscribe, hit the like button. See you next time. Have a good one.